morning guys how you doing <clears throat> so welcome back to another little vlog from me uh, what i eat in a day uh, starch solution and whole food plant-based oil free uh, with low calorie density in mind uh, i've lost 55 pounds eating this way and i'm on the final hurdle maybe like 10 or so to go uh, my name's amy otherwise known as a broccoli mum over on instagram i post a lot of stuff over there so feel free to check me out um, but yeah, I am absolutely knackered today. My little girl, uh, who's now nearly 11 months old, um, she was literally awake basically all night. I feel like I haven't slept and I'm really, really tired. I don't let that get in the way of having a nice day um, and doing some fun stuff. I do feel like when I eat this way, regardless of how much sleep I have, I always wake up with some energy. Um, and I'm much more able to get by without sleep. Um, obviously sleep is ideal but when you have a baby it's not really up to you is it so <laughs> anyway um, yeah I'm gonna crack on and have a lovely day I have some delicious breakfast waiting for me back at home um, I am doing a um, another seven day meal plan for maximum weight loss and this is one of the breakfasts <clears throat> and I'm so excited about it it is chocolatey it's delicious it's gonna be filling uh, there's loads of good stuff in there and yeah anyway I can't wait um, and you know there's going to be beans involved so anyway it is raining on my walk uh, but I don't let that stop me either I'm feeling in an optimistic kind of mood today <laughs> I set out for my walk and it was kind of drizzly and I thought you know what I'm going to do it regardless so I'm out on my walk it's rainy but I want to get those steps in and I just feel better when I start the day having some out door time um you know i've got this lovely forest around me as you can see and if i don't start my day that way <clears throat> um then i feel a bit housebound um so for me getting out of the house having a lovely walk just sets me up for the rest of the day getting in those steps and then um then i'm kind of you know not relax on the exercise front for the rest of the day but yeah it really helps me out oh somebody's awake oh yes good morning he's so sleepy Anyway, I'm going to rush home and have some breakfast, so I will see you guys then. So I just wanted to show that she is loving the rain. She woke up in such a... Uh, yes, indeed. Yes, thank you, Roy. <laughs> you crazy sausage. She woke up in such a good mood, but she's loving the rain. Just goes to show that you can enjoy any weather as long as you have the right attitude and the right clothes. So we are just... We are just enjoying our walk. Hey guys, so back from our walk and I wanted to show you my breakfast that I put together. Oh, would you look at that. So this is cherry chocolate cake. I'm having this for breakfast and I'm going to make a chocolate sauce. So who says healthy weight loss has to be um, disgusting? This is going to be incredible. I will show you what it looks like and when I put my sauce on the top, um, and there's loads of goodness in there, um, bananas, cherries, blah, 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 all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, breakfast time. So guys, check out this chocolate sauce. This is like a thick, oh, and as delicious as you can actually get. Oh man, I'm so excited. So I'm just gonna smother that all over that and then put it in there. So here is my breakfast. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like absolutely massive. Um, there's a lot in here. Um, and that's going to be so delicious. But this is a this is a meal that you can have um, in the morning or any time of the day, really, or as a snack that is great for weight loss. Um, so there's so much goodness in here as well. Yeah, I know. And Romy over there has been licking the chocolate sauce and she thoroughly enjoys it. As you can see, she's got... You tell us, Romy. You got a sticky face? Mmm, is it yummy? Yep, yeah, so the recipe for this baby and for a lot of the other stuff that I'm going to be uh, making this week is going to be in my new seven day maximum weight loss meal plan, which I am so excited about. So anyway, this is one of the breakfasts that you get to eat. You can also pair this with loads of other fruit, but I'm just going to have it like this for today. So I did just want to say, I would usually have my not sweet um, oatmeal porridge with all the fruit and the beans and stuff I would usually have that but when I'm recipe testing I'm obviously gonna eat the stuff um, now this is not too over sweet or over indulgent or anything it's still fantastic for weight loss but I am trying to just keep my sweet stuff under wraps at the moment just to listen to my hunger fullness cues um, 
yeah anyway i'm still gonna really enjoy this and it's gonna be very very delicious i will just i will show you i will show you because it's so good look at this oh my gosh mm. 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 i tell you that is good stuff good stuff well i did actually decide i wanted to bulk this out a little bit more What's some more So I decided I wanted to bulk this out a little bit more and also add a bit of a freshness. So I've just chopped an apple up and I'm just popping that bang smack in the middle. There we go. Anyway, that's going to provide a little bit of extra bulk, lower the calorie density. Um, and mm, so it is 2.30 and Romy has been asleep on me for like three hours because she did not sleep last night obviously um i've just been working away and now i am starving so i need to figure out what in the heck i am gonna eat oh yes mm, i see courgettes i'm gonna have some crispy courgettes very excited about that and i also see some leftover cabbage which i'm gonna enjoy oh yes and i'm gonna put some pasta in it mm, boom food is done plus a tomato on the top who says food has to be complicated? It can be so simple. You just need to use your brain and like figure out what you can put together. I love having cabbage and pasta because the cabbage is kind of, I cut it in like strips like pasta. And when you mix it together, it feels like you've got a massive bowl of pasta, but most of it or half of it is at least cabbage. So anyway, I'm going to put that together. That is going to be absolutely delicious. So as you can see, I've literally just thrown in the pasta, the cabbage, I chopped up a tomato, put in some nooch. I'm gonna mix it all together. I'm gonna maybe put in a bit of frozen garlic and that is gonna be delicious. If you want to know the kind of stuff my husband eats, he is addicted to kale salad. So I just made him a kale salad with tomato and some burger on the top. That is his lunch today. Hey guys, so I just wanted to show you my lunch. I am so excited. It is a gigantic feast. I mean, this thing is seriously heavy. I've made a beast right here. Um, so basically that, that was a small, relatively small, decent sized amount of pasta, but look all those veggies. This is how you can use veggies to your advantage. If you like eating big amounts of food like I do, if you are a volume eater, Veggies are your best friend. See this pasta and cabbage combination. That, when I eat that, that is literally going to taste like I've got a massive amount of pasta because I've mixed them all in together. And these crispy courgettes, oh man, they are to die for. So anyway, this is a serious feast. I'm so excited about it. But this is how you can use calorie density to your advantage. Um, and eat loads and loads and loads of delicious food and lose weight effortlessly. Anyway, so just want to show you that and I'm going to go and stuff my face um, right now. And then I have to leave to go and get my little boy. And, oh, I'm also good on this. Ah, cup of tea too. Mm. Mm. These babies. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That is the stuff right there. Mm. so i just wanted to show you i literally couldn't finish it all i am absolutely stuffed that is the power of veg anyway need to run to go and collect the boy but i will catch you later when we have dinner bye oh it's very rainy that's gonna be fun Hi guys, so I am just making dinner at the moment and I am doing ooh, a really exciting kind of white bean uh, lemon rosemary-ish kind of soup. Um, there is my instant pot with the beans right now. Um, so I just have a few things going on here and I really, really fancied some mashed potatoes. So I'm making those as well. So anyway, that is going to be dinner. I'm not quite sure how it's going to look exactly yet, but I will show you later. Hey guys, so dinner is ready and I just want to show you what I've got. So here we have it. So this is lemon and rosemary white bean soup. And I've got some mashed potatoes on there. Mm, oh my God, it's a delicious, 
it's comforting, it's hearty, it's great because it's a very rainy day today and that's just what I fancied. So uh, yeah, I'm going to go and dig into this bad boy. Um, I may have seconds if I fancy it. Um, and yeah, and then that should be it in terms of food today and then I'll have a tea later. So um, yeah, uh, if you enjoyed today's video, uh, let me know down below and feel free to subscribe if you want to see more from this face. Um, anyway, I will catch you on the next one. Let's just try this, shall we? Mm. Mm. Mm.